In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create cartoon animation with KindMaster. So if you've not subscribed to my YouTube channel, you've been missing a lot of amazing videos and more amazing videos will be coming. So kindly go to the subscription button and click and also click on the notification bell so that you'll be the first person to be notified each time I drop a new video. So stick to the end of this video because i will be showing you something special at the end of this video so let's get to work now so click on the plus sign to start a new project so we are going to use 16 is to 9 16 by 9 that will be our our ratio for this project so click 16 is to 9 so here is kind master so click on media to choose a background so go to where you have your media save so Go to where you have your media saved. Okay, I have chosen my background for this video. So, I'll be using this zoom pan to zoom this background to make it a bit animated. So, click on the zoom pan. So, I will zoom this background. In this background you can see okay that is beautiful that is beautiful so I'll still go back to the zoom button click on the end position so this time round my zoom will be on the end position Okay, so let's look at how it is. Okay, I think that is beautiful. So we'll be going to pick. I want to create the animation I want to create is a cartoon vehicle with toy inside riding so okay so we're going to pick my image I have downloaded this already so here is the first one I want to use okay so here is it So I'm bringing my vehicle to this end here. So I'm going to use this animate and this key animation key here to so that it will be it will be the car will be moving. So here is how it's going to be. So click on the vehicle. So I'll click on the animation key. Okay, scroll to the end of the vehicle. I'll track it. We'll track it to the end okay so let's see how it is now see the vehicle is okay okay that is beautiful that is beautiful so i'm also going to bring this cartoon sun so click on cartoon sun i'm going to bring it up here okay, I'm going to resize it 
I'm going to resize it. Okay. Okay, so that is beautiful. So I'm going to make it animated too. So I will also be using this animated key to select animated key. I've selected it already. So click on the animated key. I will drag to the end of the sun. So also drag it to where you want it to stop. So I want it to move to this ending and disappear. So I'm going to do that. So let's see how it goes. Okay, that is beautiful. So I also want some some bird to fly on the sky. So I have my bed already. I've told you stay to the stick of the video. I'm going to tell you how I get some of this material. I'm going to show you the trick, the method I used to get this material. So I have my bed already. So I'm also going to bring them in. I'm going to bring them in. I'm going to bring my bed in. Okay, so I have my bed flying. So I'm going to use I'm going to use chroma key to remove this green color. So I've removed the green color. So let's see. So I'm going to cut it here. Don't need this part. This is the only part I want. So the bed also should be above. So I'm going to take it up here. And I also want it to fly. So I'm also going to use this animation animation key. Okay, I'm going to use this animation key. So I will drag this, this to the end. Okay, so let's see how it is. Okay, that is beautiful. So I also want another card to pass after this one. So I have about two cards. So So I'll bring in the next car. So go to my layer. Go to media. Why save my car? Go to download. That is where my car is safe. So here is the second car. Okay. Okay. I want it to start to come out from this end. Okay. So I will also be using my animation key. So, so I will track it to the end. Okay, that is beautiful. So let's see how it goes. okay so so that is beautiful so let's bring a small stand click my layer and my download where i have my my pizza okay so i'm going to i'm going to resize it it's going to be somewhere here. Okay. Let's see how it goes. Okay.
okay no so let's shift it down here okay so this is what we are going to do we click on these three dots you want to send it behind you want, you want to send it behind so click on the three dots we have duplicate bring to front so we we'll click bring backward so let's bring it back and see okay click the three dots send it back it has gone to back now okay that is beautiful that is beautiful so we also want it to be animated let's add some animation and see how it will go so let's see how it will go hello guys i told you to stay to the end of the video because i have something special to show you so here is a video bonus for you staying to the end of this video okay so i want to show you how i got my cartoon and how i got those birds that were flying okay i told you a video bonus for you thank you for staying to the end of this video so here is how I got my cartoon. So if you go to Play Store, search for this app here. This app, VFX Video. So here is the app. Now, this app contains many app, contains many video, animals video. And they are all with green back background meaning that you can easily remove it using your chroma key so here is the app vfx that is none of the app you've seen there are many so this is the particular one that i use here is, here is the particular one i use so the other this is crocodile can easily remove this background using your chroma key and use it make sure your video creates wonderful and amazing video okay that is number one so number two you can go to your browser and browse any image you want to let's say you want to get a toy car so you can just go to any browser you're using and browse for a toy car so after then how do you get your background removed so go to go to remove remove.bg so here is the app remove.bg so once you come here use it to remove your background you can replace it with a green background so that when you import it to your video editor you can use it to remove your green background and you use that to create your amazing video so i hope this is help helpful so make sure you drop your comment you drop your observation you drop your question on the comment section thank you very much for staying to the end of the video see you in the next video